everyone, um, I did say I'll come back and show you um, how to do another tag and for that one I'm going to use these little bits and pieces here because you don't have to do Halloween. Do you remember we were doing these last night? You don't have to do Halloween. Um, and so this is my little tag, make sure you can see of what I'm going to do, uh, create with mine. And I've got one of these, a little clay ladybird got some flowers, my butterfly and um, what I've done, I've taken the board, I've covered it in white paper and then I've sprayed it using the uh, Cosmic Shimmer which is the Antique Rose uh, and now what I'm going to do is just decorate it up um, and first of all, let me find, what's this one? my uh, ink and for this I'm just going to use a walnut stain on the edges um, and just darken it up a little bit And I think we'll do the reverse side as well and then it's done with. And these are very, very quick and easy to do, these tags. as well um, and I'm going to choose that side as the front now all I have to do is to glue on um, my flowers in that so I've chosen the certain ones and I'm just gonna pop that on there but quickly before I do that I need to have this one underneath as well I'm not going to press that down just yet and I want that sticking out there not bothered about it going over the edges because we can trim off anything we don't need and then I'm going to take hold of the die cut flowers that I've chosen Like I said, these are very, very quick and easy projects to make. Very quick, actually. Like that. Taking the butterfly. You can do it and pop dot it or something like that. I'm not going to because I'm going to uh, go over mine with some Mod Podge. But you could do all your Mod Podge now and then pop dot, dot, pop dot this. I just want it to go there, like that, press that nice and firm. Not bothered about the antennae because when I Mod Podge it that will glue that down. Uh, I'm not putting on any of these just yet, these little trimmings. Um, but you can see that looks quite pretty. And um, I'm going to leave this open because whoever I give that to I will put the name on. Um, so what I'm going to do next is just to, um, oh, do you know what I've just never thought of? Where's my um, cloth? Eee, lassie, come on, get organised. And for everybody that uh, inquired, I am fine. Um, my eye is still very swollen. In fact, it swelled up more yesterday than it did the day before. But I understand that's... Um, as it should be and if it doesn't go down then I will be going back to the doctors and asking them why so what we're going to do now is just slap a load of um, slap a load add a load of um, Mod Podge to this 
which not only seals it, it helps it and it'll preserve it a little bit like that like I say, very quick and very easy to make up of these and you buy these, um, like I say, I got mine on the car boot but if you go to a second hand shop, if there are any kiddies things, go and look in the kiddies section um, or your pound shop or something for games and things like that these are the uh, you know like you could learn how to spell how to um, count and things like that and I bought a stack of them it was about 50 odd for about a pound and that's all they were selling the box for and I've made all sorts with them but for now that's all I'm going to do with that I am going to help dry that off um, but I just want to get a little bit of lace small bit big enough to go across the bottom section that'll do fine just going to dry that off a touch you see just how quick and easy these are to make And that cools, as that cools down that will completely dry that um, I am going to use a bit of the uh, bling I think let's have a look I'm not sure where I'm going to put it but we shall see let's have a look I actually want it there, just there. I just think it will set that off really nicely. And then all I'm going to do is to add a little bit of lace. I hope you can still see this. These are great little projects for newbies. If you're new to scrapbooking and you're not quite sure what to do. I mean, you could just cut a piece of chipboard if you've got it. Yeah, looks fine. Just a minute. Also just going to add a little bit of this trimming on because I love this. Just over that. Just take a little bit of ribbon.
a little bit of glue on there. Turn that over. And we just add that to the centre. And we can pop a little flower, oh it's not quite in the centre, we can pop a little flower on there or something like that. Um, take the little bead pop that on the body where you want it to go take the little um, ladybird and we're just going to pop that on there and there you go you've got a pretty little pl <laughs> plaque and they're just so e excuse me just so easy to do and look fab and then you can just put somebody's name on that how quick and easy is that i hope you enjoyed that i hope it's shown you and helped you um the easy way to do something it's nothing's too complicated once you know how thanks for watching speak to you soon take care bye bye for now i'm just going to leave the camera rolling because i've just got a little thing to do and i'll probably make a cock up here but who cares <laughs> I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> so I'll just leave the camera rolling a minute. While I figure out what I'm going to do. There we go. Not sure if it'll work, but we shall try. Just have a hint of something in the background. And all you do is dry that off. Bye bye for now. <laughs>